There are almost 2 billion pictures taken every day, but some are more powerful than others. Whether it's lucky timing or being in the right place, some pictures go on to define events by capturing our attention. To make sure you're not disturbed, don't forget to subscribe to Capital. Make sure to watch closely and comment below for a chance to be featured in an upcoming video. Got to be a joker cause he's so hard to please. John Lennon. In a tragic twist of fate, the last photo taken of John Lennon was with the man that killed him. On December 8, 1980, Mark David Chapman waited all day outside the home of John Lennon in New York City, speaking with other fans and amateur photographer Paul Gorish. Around 5 p.m., Lennon left the building for a photo shoot, greeting fans and signing autographs before they departed. This photograph by Gorish shows John Lennon signing a copy of his album Double Fantasy for Chapman in the background. Later that night, when Lennon returned, Chapman shot him five times and then proceeded to read a copy of Catcher in the Rye while waiting for police to arrive. Lennon was rushed to Roosevelt Hospital but was declared dead at 11.07 p.m. Chapman was sentenced to 20 years to life for the murder and has been denied parole nine times. Don't forget to check out our other videos! And while you're still here, be sure to click subscribe so you never miss a minute from Capital.